Hey everybody, welcome back. As always, I am Skullman, and um, in the last episode, I tried going off against um, Doc Ock over here, and um, it didn't go out so well. I tried at least another, at least another time on like on camera, and still didn't do too well. And so. I kind of get. I called. I kind of called it quits in the in the last episode. I was at, I was at the uh, main boss. I was at the the uh, Maverick select screen, and that's where I left it off. But I'm gonna try again here to go up against Mr. Octopus. I forget his first name right now, so that's why I'm calling him Dog Oc, Mr. Octopus, whatever. And. I and off camera I've been trying I've been like let's see how can I put this um like while like before like off camera I was trying multiple times to see if I can beat him I didn't beat him but I was really close to beating him so and I think I might have a little strategy and I might have a little bit of a strategy so let's see if it actually works this time around and away we go. And one thing I realized is that he takes a long time to get down here. So like he floats down and then he taunts us saying you're going down. And then, okay, I always get hit there. No biggie. Yeah, when he does that attack and if you're like caught in the, um, hold on, damn, if you're like caught underneath it, he grabs onto you and you take a lot of damage until you find a way to break free and he can do this repeatedly and it gets really annoying cuz I'm trying to get a shot off with the damn armadillo barrier and he just blocked it with one of his stupid projectiles yeah you really yeah you see here you go here we go here we go that's what I meant Ugh, I really hate this guy one thing I realized is that getting hit by his like like his uh, fish and little things like that don't do that much damage. The, ol the only big damage comes from when he actually touches you. When he touches you, that's when you lose a lot of health. That's when you get hit the most. So, uh, I think it still might be enough. I'm gonna try it. Li I'm gonna try it one more time like this. If it, if I can't beat him this time, then I'm just going to try a bit more off camera until I actually beat him. Probably not. This probably doesn't seem like the best strategy, but whatever. Because I really want to get. The, I really want to beat this guy. I checked the guides, and they say that after beating Armadillo, Octopus is the next one to go up against. So that that's what I'm trying to do, but it's just not working out for me. Yeah, see, like, see, like, his, like, little piranha fish and stuff only do, like, like, two, maybe three little bars of damage. But if he touches you, it does, like, a hell of a lot more. It does, like, six. Honestly. Stop shooting. It's my turn to shoot. Okay, I think I got hit by his, like, stupid little piranha fish there, so that's okay. Uh, already I feel like I'm doing a little bit better. Don't, don't, uh, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me, back off, get your own sandwich, no, crap, shit, okay, we're almost there, but he, stop doing, uh, ah, damn it, so close, so close, he was, he was like that close to dying, but we had just run out, see, I ran out, okay, so, actually what I'm going to do, since, as you all know, I'm doing this on an emulator, um, I actually have a uh, save stage. I have, I have like a save stage right here in this area. Like right where you saw me at the beginning of this episode. That's where the save, uh, that's where the, uh, save stage is for me. And, uh, yeah. So I'm going to go back to that and try a hell of a lot more times while I'm still recording to see if I can actually beat him. 
So, yeah. I'll be back. I am not gonna take a chance. But this is chance, what, number five now, I think? Yeah, five sounds about right. Okay, so let's see, what do we, what do you do? First off, you always do that. I think I jumped, yeah, I jumped way too high that time. Uh, I'm already not liking this opening. This beginning, this beginning battle. Not, I'm already not liking it. Not my favorite. No, don't get out, get out, get out, get out. Yes, mosquito bite. Bite mosquito. That was a, that was a waste. Okay, so far I'm doing okay. That was a waste. Unfortunately. Get out. Jump. Yes, jump and shoot. Jump and shoot. He doesn't... He can't beat me. Oi, I... Yes. One more. No. Damn it. Yes! Yes! Finally! Yes! We freaking got you, little bastard! We finally got you! <laughs> Yes! Oh boy, yes! I feel so much better now. Oh, thank God. Thank God. We finally got you. Exxon out of here. Okay, so... What do we get from that? Homing Torpedo. That's what his name is. Launch Octopus. Launch. For some reason, it just doesn't fit. Because... What do octopuses launch? Or what's about them that launches? I mean, penguins, they live in, like, Antarctica. So, and it's pretty chill there. So, that I get. That made sense. So, chill penguin made sense. Um, spark mandrel. That, okay, that really doesn't, that doesn't make sense. Not at all, because they're monkeys. I mean, again, they're... They're they're like Rafiki from The Lion King. They don't have any electricity, so clearly that doesn't make any sense. Um, armored armadillo, sure, that does make sense because armadillos do have like a they have a protective uh, shell on their back, and which they can curl up into a ball. And yeah. So that makes sense, but launch octopus and spark mandrill so far do not make any sense whatsoever. But who cares? We finally beat launch octopus. Oh my god, I feel so happy now. I feel so much better. <sighs> Gee, it only took me, what, five attempts, five more tries. That's not so bad. Alright. So, I think in the next episode, if I remember reading the guide correctly, I think the next one we're going up against is Boomer Kuwanger. And I also did a little bit of research into what exactly a Kuwanger is. And... I think it's Japanese for like some sort of stag beetle or something like that. So, yes. So, I don't know. Quanger is a beetle. This is what I'm getting at, essentially. Oh, and I just realized uh, we defeated four of the Mavericks. Four of the eight. We're halfway through. That's awesome. And, you know, after the first. Uh, once we get rid of all eight of them here, uh, we then go off to fight, well I'm assuming we get to fight Vile again, and then go over to Sigma? Maybe. Not too sure about that, but I could be right. But who cares, that's all another, those are all future episodes. So until next time, this is Skullman012291. Signing out. Peace.